starts right now. Our big story at 11, a fire tears through a part of downtown East Troy. The fire started around 2 this morning in a building with both a business and apartments, and it quickly spread. Fox 6's Angelica Duria has the latest. We are here right outside of that building, and you can see the damage right behind me. That building with apartments and businesses completely destroyed. The roof actually caved in, and now crews are working to clean up all the debris. The good thing here is with such a large fire, everyone who lived inside, they were able to get out unharmed. Now this fire started just before two o'clock this morning. There are four apartments on the second floor and on the first floor. There was an antique shop, a home health care office, and that fire then spread to a second building where a barber shop was located. Now those buildings appear to be total losses. It took firefighters more than three hours to get it under control. You can see the flames shooting out of one of those buildings. Now the police chief says six people lived inside. The good thing here again, everyone was able to get out unharmed. Unfortunately, though, four animals, a cat, two snakes and a lizard were killed in that fire. The resident was not able to grab those pets during that fire. Now we did speak to another resident. She says her neighbor knocked on her door while she was sleeping and told her to escape the building. It just, I could smell the smoke. And my neighbor knocked on the door and told me to get out because there's a fire. Now nearly half a dozen people are displaced. They have no homes at this hour and are trying to figure out where to go from here. As for the investigation, fire officials are still trying to determine a cause and an origin. They do say that this building is more than 100 years old. It was built in the early 1900s. It's been rehabbed several times. But as for uh, whether the condition of that building played a role in this fire, that has yet to be determined. Reporting in East Troy, Angelica Duria, Fox 6 News.